Hello everyone, welcome to Let's Play Budborn. This is Nosp, and let's jump right in. Oh, yeah. Hell. <laughs> well, you've come to the right place. Yarnum is the home of blood ministration. You need only unravel its mystery. But where's an outsider like yourself to begin? Easy, with a bit of yarn and blood of your own. But first, you'll need a contract. A contract? We have to make it some kind of deal? Ah, we have to tell them who we are. Well, quick disclaimer as we start up here. Um, I have played this game before, so this is not a completely blind run. However, it's been about, actually, almost exactly five years since I last played it, and I didn't get very far when I first played it, so I don't really know very much about this game. Um, so we're just going to have to discover most of it as we go through, but I knew a little bit. But I'm actually going to cut while I do my character creation here, and I'll come back when I have it all set up. Alright guys, we're all done making our dude guy here. He's got some long wild band hair and beards because he's been adventured in whatever land this is going to be. So let's jump right in and find out as we finalize our contract. All I remember is there's like a few different weapons I can choose to start from, I think. And there's a gun and dodging, kind of, like dashing. And parrying with gunshots, I remember that. As far as like story stuff, not a lot though. Not a lot. Good. All signed and sealed. Now, let's begin the transfusion. Oh. Oh, don't you worry. Whatever happens, you may think it all. I don't like the sound of this. this. What did I just sign, actually? All I did was make my dude. I didn't actually... There there was no, like, terms and conditions. What's going on? We're still alive. That's a good sign. What the... <laughs> That's not a good sign, though. If I started seeing that, I would panic pretty hard, I think. Is it like... Whoa. I thought it was trying to like make me a deal or something. Oh man. If it's not like blood werewolves, then it's these things. And what are these things? Oh, I'm not sure if they're much better. Oh, they seem far worse. Ah, that looks horrible. Ah, you found yourself a hunter. All right. Well, we are still alive after all that. And here we are in a clinic where something happened. Something that probably, I don't know if it was good for us or not. There's a door here and a door there. Let's try this door first. It does not open from this side. That feels like classic Dark Souls. What else can we do? We can punch. And punch with the other hand. There's the dodge. Uh, there's the use item that I have none. We got a little bit of health and stamina in the top left there. Got some heavy and light attacks. Oh, we can like two hand it looks like. Two handed punches. Yeah, that's where it's at. Alright, what's in here? Something on the floor here. Oh, tutorial stuff, cool. See if there's anything that I can't just... Oh, yeah. Pre pretty much Dark Souls controls. I'm pretty familiar with those. 
I remember, I do remember there's something in here. And I, yeah, there it is. I do remember, aha. That looks kind of like the thing that, like, uh, appeared in a pool of blood in our dream, question mark? Can I fight this thing? I'm making a lot of noise by creaking on these boards. Yep, it, it hurt me. Ooh, that's a big bad. Oh, you know what? Hmm, can I? Let's see. Whoa. Bap. Well, he didn't like that. He didn't like that at all, yeah. What do you got, punk? Yeah, he does not like getting hit, hit in the back like that. Can do like these cool dashes. That looked like a grab. Okay, he seems to get like stunned whenever I punch him, so I might stand a chance. Whoa. Boom. Yeah, I get butt punched. I, it might work when I just like punch him in the side too, but I'm not gonna go for that. Yeah, he gets stunned whenever I punch him anyways. Alright, so we can we definitely stand a chance here. We have no healing items or anything like that, but I believe. Boom, boom. Self has gone down significantly. That counts. Yeah, big face punches. I yeah, keep going for those grabs. Oh, no, no. Don't go for those attacks. Oh, oh yeah, you can like steal. Ooh. I remember just now that you can steal your HP back after they damage you if you hit them back and soon enough, but I got pinned in the corner. That's bad. We did pretty good, though. If I can uh, manage to be a little bit faster with my dodging and maybe have him break apart some of the environment more. Oh. Well, I guess dying there kind of moves us on anyways. I haven't been known. I got my butt whooped. <laughs> Well, where are we now? And how did we get here? We got killed by the the crazy thing and we just come back here. Wherever here is. The hunter's dream. Whoa, there's those creepy things again. And there's a thing person here. Hello? An abandoned doll, okay. Interesting. Awaken at a selected location. Oh, okay, so I can just go back there and get my butt whooped again. Awesome. A trick weapon. Trick weapons are yielded with the right hand. Oh yeah, this is what I remember. You can pick from three. You get the saw cleaver, the hunter axe, and the threaded cane. I'm going to take the cane because I remember this was like the one I liked the most. But I've seen in... Uh, like speed runs and stuff, people I think use this one, and this one also seems pretty sweet. I think it's like a two-handed, two-handed axe or something like that, or it can be two-handed. But this one's really cool, in my opinion. All right, and we get a firearm. Yeah, like I was saying earlier, we get guns. So I honestly considered doing like a gun-only run, but unlike Dark Souls, it seems like it would be a lot more challenging. Maybe I could do it if I can beat the game normally. That's what I'm thinking. Uh, notebooks. Leave messages with these servants. Share them with hunters in other worlds. Okay. So that's kind of like the stones in Dark Souls. Closed? Wow, you bring me here and then you're closed? That seemed pretty lame. Alright, so... Got to uh, equip my arms here. Get my cane. There we go. Look at that. It's like a little sword, but it's a cane. I don't remember how you, like, do things to it, so we'll find out later on. You'll see what I mean. Trade in blood echoes with messengers. Buy and sell items. All right, well, I don't have any money, I don't think, so we're not going to do that. And let's go up this side. Maybe this door is open. Nope, just double closed. All right, well... I think we can go back to the sick room now that we have a weapon and a gun. Two weapons, actually. What's up? Our first floor sick room. Oh, don't don't offer them your hand. Creepy little dudes. I don't know what they are. 
I wouldn't want to be touching on things like that, man. You get like sucked into the underworld or they eat your soul or something like that. Some wild. I should probably be reading about these items so I know what to be looking for, but I've just been completely not paying attention to what they are at all. I've completely missed all of them. Alright, we're back in the clinic. We're in the room with the dog thing. Alright, so let's see if I can... Yeah, okay, here's the left button. So left bumper changes this from a sword to like a whip. Yeah. Let's go rock it. What's up? Dog thing. Look at all that damage. Oh, shoot. He's still vicious though. Oh, no. Weapons did nothing. <laughs> he completely demolished me again. I got way too confident and I had used like the left bumper and I guess that was enough of a delay between the attack to allow him enough frames to kill me. Or rather I got stuck in the corner again. I think I should have used my gun, but hey, I respawned right here. Man, that's really unfair for him. So, ah, I killed that guy, what a punk. And I'm like, yo, what's up? I'm back already. Oh, heavy attack just demolished him. Let's do those. There we go. What's up? Yeah. Got my blood echoes back. No, I didn't really have any. Three blood vials. I think I can use those to heal myself, if I recall correctly. Yeah, I use triangle to use a blood vial. Okay, so don't randomly press triangle. That's one thing I'm going to really have to remember and focus on. I feel like I'm going to just randomly do it sometimes, just because I feel like most of the games I've played, I just use triangle, and I don't know why, but that's making me feel like I'm going to mess it up. I think I've done it a few times already. All right, what's out here? Got some items, got some graves. Don't usually like graves, those usually mean bad guys. But let's go. Got some bullets. I should remember this because I have played this, but I really don't remember. Close by a device. Okay, whoa. I hear like something. Something's walking around. Here's some steps. It's spooking me really badly. Alright, well, let's move around. Can't be too terrifying. Can it? We'll find out. Alright, we can open this gate. That is super duper noisy though. I'm sure the whole damn area knows we're opening this door now. Alright, we're like we're in central Yarnum. Let's see what's up. Maybe we'll find whatever's walking around. Is there anything over here? It's just some items as far as I can tell. More blood vials, nice. Now what's uh, anything over here? No, here's something dragging. Oh, there's a torch moving. Okay, we do have some hostiles. Let's mosey on in. Go whip mode. Aha! Oh shoot. What's up? Keep our range from him. Whoa, he like screamed. It terrified me for a second. He's got quite the battle cry. Right, I don't know if I want to open that one yet. Can I open it? That's closed by a device. Classic. Alright. Let's move on. There's got to be more enemies. Let's go back to smack em mode. Blood vials. Nice. Is there any enemies over? Oh, hello. Let's get him before he gets up. What's up, punk? Oh, he's got a friend. Alright. Keep our range on this one. Boom! Shot, shot him in the face. Alright. Not bad. That went a lot smoother than everything else so far. Some cocktails. Throw those at people and light them on fire. That sounds fantastic. What's this do? Just open that. Whoa! Oh, okay, that drops the ladder. Sweet. Let's climb up. Been pretty... Wow, that sounded awful. Oh man, this game's had a lot of like sensory nightmares so far with the sights and sounds. 
got a lantern thingy here. Let's light it up. Oh, sweet. Okay, it's like a bonfire from Dark Souls. What's that sound? Oh, hello. Ooh, you must be a hunter. And not one from around here either. I'm Gilbert, a fellow outsider. You must have had a fine time of it. Yarnum has a special way of treating guests. Well, I don't think I could stand if I wanted to, but I'm willing to help if there's anything that can be done. <laughs> this town is cursed. Whatever your reasons might be, you should plan a swift exit. Whatever can be gained from this place, it will do more harm than good. Well, that doesn't sound like I should be here, and, uh, yeah, I also don't know how I got here, so, yeah, I would also like to leave. Pale blood, you say? Hmm. I've never heard of it. But if it's blood you're interested in, you should try the Healing Church. The Church controls all knowledge on blood ministration and all varieties of blood. Across the valley to the east of Yarnum lies the town of the Healing Church known as the Cathedral Ward. And deep within Cathedral Ward is the old Grand Cathedral, the birthplace of the Healing Church's special blood. Or so they say. <laughs> it sounds like a lot of work to just go find out. don't share much with outsiders. Normally they wouldn't let you near the place, but the hunt is on tonight. This might be your chance. And what does that mean? Oh my god, there's so much happening here. Across the valley to the deep within lies the old name. I haven't heard of pale blood, but that's your best bet if it's anything to do with unique types of blood. <laughs> that's pretty much what he just said. Across the deep valley. Yep. Alright, well, that's that. It doesn't open from this side. Okay, man, we gotta go to the healing church to... And then kind of go like super duper deep in some cathedral to the old cathedral. Then go in there to find some birthplace of the special blood. What is this all going to mean? What is blood ministration? Why did I have a transfusion? And what changed? And oh, that sent a huge shock up my spine. I'm still feeling the shock from that. Please don't do that again, sir. This place is cursed. That guy's right. Alright, I'm pretty sure I don't want to jump down here. That's a mean looking dude right there. I'm sure he's got friends. I mean, there's those guys down there, obviously, but he's probably got like hidden friends. And I ain't about that. Plus, we'll probably miss out on treasures since we haven't gone like the, probably the atypical path yet. Boom, shoot that shield. What's up? Yeah, what's up? You ain't got nothing. Blood vials, nice. Alright, ooh, hello. Gang of friends. Let's see, do we have like a... Alright, we can sprint, so we can probably do like a sprinting attack. Surprise these guys from behind. How's that sound? I don't know. About to find out. Got one. Ooh, he had an extra friend. Bonus friend. I didn't see bonus friend. Yeah, you guys can't stand the whip. What's up? Alright, this last guy. Sword mode. Oh man, he dropped his shield at the worst time. Should I heal? Yeah, I'm gonna heal. Wait. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I made bullets. See? I knew I'd get it confused. There we go. Now I'm back where I started. Uh -huh. <laughs> All right, well, we'll wait till I take another hit before I press triangle to heal and not up on the D-pad to create bullets, apparently, out of blood, blood bullets. All right, is there anything down here? This is the door that we came, or couldn't come in before, I believe. Nothing over, th oh, I heard something. Oh, there's something. I'm gonna open this before that comes and gets me, whatever that is. That thing looks pretty big. Alright. 
Ooh, it is pretty big. I don't know if I want to mess with him yet. He looks a little scary. Instead, let's go over here. It's like some kind of like uh, statue there. That's cool. Got like some Victorian style carriages or stuff or whatever here. I'm probably getting that wrong, but hopefully you know what I mean. Some old time stuff. Okay, this is pro. Yeah, that's the ledge we could have jumped off at the start, so. Nobody's coming to get me yet. I know there's this one guy. I ain't too worried about that one guy, but. Oh, he ain't even up here anymore. Where'd he go? I hear voices. I hear like a lot of crying. It's kind of spooking me out. And you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Wow. Why not? And you that outsider? Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? All right, I guess so. Won't talk to me at all. Jeez, don't know what I did. There's like wailing coming from in there though, like people are like crying and... Oh, there's dudes down there. Hmm. Is that the last of the dudes? It seems to be. I'll probably get him by himself. What's up? You don't see me coming. Aha! Have at you, punk. You got no friends? Good. Good, good, good. This is going just excellent. Alright. Catch you by surprise. And the last of your friends. Boom! Right in the face. With my blood bullet. Yeah. He just said I'm cursed. That's not good. You do not want people saying that to you right as they die. That's pretty bad news. I would say. Oh, can I knock on this door? Has a little lantern. I can. Lad, you come on. You don't open the door on the night of the hunt. Away with you now. Oh yeah, like that guy said, it's the night of the hunt. Lad, you come on. Can I just like go to sleep and wake up tomorrow when it's not the night of the hunt and like, you know, maybe have like a normal exit? Hello, you are setting up to ambush me. That's really mean. What a guy. Yeah, I'm, I'm fully on board with like finding like a, one of these boxes to like, whoa, have a nap in. And uh, like even this bench, you know, just cover yourself in a few of these sacks, you know, build up a little barricade for myself. Maybe even hop back there, you know, just set up a nice little nap. Hell, even hop this fence and get back there somewhere. Yeah, they all seem pretty occupied with like wandering around down here, so I think uh Whoa! I'm gonna press triangle off that one. Probably could have smacked them, but I was a little bit scared there. I don't think so, buddy. Ooh, I got him in one heavy attack? I don't remember that. That's pretty sweet to kill him in one hit. Alright, can I knock on this door? No. It seems like the the uh, doors with uh, those little pink lanterns in front of them. It seems to be like a sign of like, hey, normal people live here. Don't, don't attack us. Maybe, I don't know. Oh, oh, I hear. Oh man. Let's run, 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 run. All right, whip chain mode. All right, multiple enemies. One problem. Oh. Wrong button. Oh man, the range is so small. There we go. Alright. That worked out. Heal up. Boom. Alright, now where's the last guy? Oh, here's another guy. Wrecked. Oh, I got the sweet counter. What's up, punk? Get put down. Get my blood vial back and everything. Feels great. Alright, more bullets. We're pretty stocked up on bullets now. Alright, let's just surprise this guy. Boom! Yeah, comboed. Alright, nothing down there. 
I knock on this door? Nope. Something banging on the door? Oh, something banging on that door. Oh, okay. That's a little spooky. Why is there something on that side of the door? Why are you guys on this side of the door? What's that? I didn't know there was some kind of like effigy on that. Oh, it looks like one, maybe one of those like uh, werewolf creatures that I fought earlier. Yeah, it kind of looks like that. Why? What the heck is going on, man? This is some wildness. Uh, let's go back here. I don't want to like push forward from that stair I was at. I want to have some space. Let's use the, the good old whip here. Alright, let's try it. Ooh, someone shot me. I'm getting shot at. Alright, well that, that was definitely not safe. They have range, but I have range too. Ha ha. That worked out pretty good. Alright, but they were shooting at me. I don't know what to do about that. You know, I'm gonna have to go around the other side. This was a mistake. Mistakes were definitely made coming to this side. So let's move back to the other side. And then we can try to pull them up through this. Because I think these little railings will actually kind of protect me. All my fault. What I do? I mean, I, yeah, I guess I have done a pretty awful thing so far to your friends and you, but I don't think it's fair to say it's all my fault. I'm not that guilty. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Alright. Boom. Didn't get the cool parry stun that time, but still shut that attack down. Alright, there's still one guy dragging his axe and another guy uh, shooting a gun. Or a rifle, I should say. Wait till that guy drags his axe a little bit farther away, I think. There we go. Alright, now we can go in. Let's uh, dodge that bullet. And the other one apparently. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. Oh, no. I got punked. Oh, damn. Oh, and there was dogs there. Oh, man. Alright, well, definitely learned a bit of a lesson there. So, in this next attempt, probably kill those other guys a little bit faster, because now I know what they're up up to. And, uh, yeah, we'll be a little bit more careful killing out, or clearing out that second part with the, with the rifle dudes. That was a little bit trickier than I expected. Yeah, totally saw you coming. No big deal. Carve you up. Charge down here. Wait till this guy maybe lowers his shield to do an attack. Alright, well, I tried to do like a parry thing, but did not seem necessary. I don't think I have to wait for these guys because, um. Okay, well, he can hit me through that. That gave me a bit of a surprise. <laughs> Okay, yep. Some of these guys got a little bit more range than I would expect and can hit me in ways I do not expect at all. That guy's got a lot of HP, actually. Alright, we want to keep our health up. I am, uh, I did pick Waste of Skin as my class because it just had the, uh, lowest, um, lowest starting level, and that means I get more customization as I level up, so... That was my thought process on that, but I am pretty squishy, so I do have to be be, be extra careful. Alright. Let's uh, go up here. I believe there might be someone to take care of. See, yeah, these little um, lanterns, that's what I was talking about, in front of the houses or, or doors where there's people that are alive. See, there's one right there, too. Alright, so I know there's this guy. Carve you up. And there's another guy trying to shock me up here. Yep, this weapon's pretty good so far. No complaints. Another guy gonna jump out at me right here. 
shut that down. Alright, yep, yep, cursed, whatever. These guys start coming up. Oh, this guy came from somewhere. Oh, that guy came from somewhere. Oh, he hit me pretty hard, too. Give me my life back. Shoot him a couple times, just let him know who's boss. Alright, get a couple blood vials right on. Alright, that seems to be most of them. Let's make sure we get this guy. I don't want anyone to come out and surprise me. It's my deal now. Because I didn't know there was, like, dogs and stuff last time. And that would have made things a lot worse. Okay, so we're back here. Let's heal up. Just got a pretty good stockpile of blood vials here. Two more right there. Let's try and pull some more of these guys. Dig it on this weapon for. Oh, I got my echoes back right on. Uh, for helping me uh, deal with groups of enemies. It's pretty nice. Let's see if this guy will just come after me. Doesn't look like he's too interested. Oh man, this is a tough part to deal with, I feel like. Be nice if those guys would come up here and like try to fight me too. Alright, come on man. You can do it. I believe in you. Wow, and he drops the shield at the worst possible time. What a guy. He's not very good at this game, I gotta say. Alright, let's actually dash over here. Dodge some shots because I just realized I saw an item. Alright, oh, hello person that chased me that I didn't see. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, 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 guys. No one told me this was going to be a party. I was just coming over this way for my own purposes. Oh. Wow, apparently that was a, a counter and I had no idea. I just came up and smacked him again. Alright, well we cleared out three guys I didn't even mean to kill, so I'm pretty happy about that. Let's see, can we just run up here and kind of like deal with this guy? Ah, oh, that helps a lot. Dodge that. Right, knocked him on his on his butt anyway. It's pretty alright. Oh, we got shot. That sucks. Knocked him on his butt again. Oh, I saw one of those dog things on the move. Heal up. Maybe not. Oh, yep. Oh, they ran up this side. Oh, that's terrifying. Oh, I can get this guy, maybe? Aha! Oh, yeah, you did. Mistakes were made by you. Hello, sir. Oh, got the dog. I don't like killing dogs in games, it always feels bad, but that one was definitely evil, I gotta say. Aha! Significant progress. Alright. Don't know if there's more dogs. I think there's only the one. It doesn't have any more friends just hanging out. His arms are really long, I gotta say. We got an item here. I'm kind of scared to grab it, but he's been banging on the thing for a while, so I'm gonna grab it. All right, we're good. We're good. We got another item here. We're spoiled. We gotta figure out how to get it though. And then another item that I missed. Cold blood dew. What's that do? Oh, oh, I healed by accident. Knew I'd do that at some point. All right, let's see. It says used to gain blood echoes. Okay, well that's not too. Uh, too exciting, but still exciting. Some more bullets. Happy to get those. So yeah, okay. That seems to be this part. Except for that one guy that was uh, walking around way back uh, 
near the lever that I pulled. Alright, so we're on the other side of the door. That guy clearly doesn't know that there's actually a uh, little hallway right there. Bloodstone shard. What's that for? Embed in a weapon to fortify. And we have two of them. Okay, cool. Sounds pretty sweet. Got some giggles coming from here. So we got another one of these lanterns here. Item in there? Nope, just my imagination. I don't reckon you're from round here. Well, stuck outside on a night of the hunt. Ah, we poor, poor thing. <laughs> and she just laughs at me. Wow. My man. I don't reckon you're <laughs> Oh, well. Oh man, that kind of like is disturbing that there's a lot of people that are just like hanging out inside on the night of the hunt as they call it. Alright, let's explore around here. Don't see any enemies. Oh, yep, my mistake. There's little weird crow things. What the devil are you things? Pebble. Oil urns. Nice. Alright, well that's uh... That was creepy. I didn't expect those little bird things. There's that big guy. Well, we'll go take him on in a second, but I want to see if there's anything I might be missing here first, or any enemies that might ambush me while I fight him. Seems to be a common theme. Alright, nobody here. Another cold blood dew. Probably use those later to gain some levels before uh continue too much adventure. Oh, I hear enemies, yep. I see a doggo. He's pretty upset. He dodged my bullet. Alright, well we got him though. There's another one and a couple of dudes and another one. Oh man. And we still, okay, I definitely want to kill these guys before I go deal with the angry dude. Can I, like, get the dog to run at me first? Oh, there's three dudes there? Oh, man, I didn't see that. All right, nope, we got to go whip mode. Hope for the best, whip mode. Away, screw you. You're the one that came at me. Jeez, dude. And this guy's just going to be like, oh, I'm a gun user. Oh, and then he's going to shoot me. Alright, well, yeah, not going to gamble. Come down here, man. Okay. Yeah, he, he, uh, he came to help them. I am so glad I survived that, but also... Wow. I didn't expect that to happen. I thought it was going to be the other way around, that if I... Oh, if I attacked him, they'd come. I'm going to heal again, because I want to be full health if that guy's going to be trying to smack me with that giant thing he had in his hand. He gone back? No. Where'd they go? Alright, well. Take those. Can't open that door. Maybe I should equip those Molotovs. Just in case. All right, well, let's see. So now we got a guy with a gun, a guy with a hammer fist, and... Is that him right there? That's him right there, okay. All right, we got one. Oh, run, run, run. Alright, dog does not seem to be aggroed. And this guy also doesn't seem to want to come over here now. Interesting. Why don't you want to come? Dude, you started over here. What are you doing? Alright, that's one attack. Boom. Saw through that. Saw through that one too. 
guy's jokes. What's up? Alright, give me that, blood vials. Nice. Okay, well, that was something. That was definitely something. I don't see any more dudes except for this this doggo. Shoot him. Did not, oh man, six more blood vials? That's awesome. I am feeling in pretty good shape right now. That sounded like a really loud wolf howl. Oh, that's two wolves. Oh, not just wolves, those are werewolves. That's terrifying. What's over there? Oh, man. Can I just fight one? One would be cool. Can I run over here? Is this safe? Is there items? No? Just nightmares? Just nightmares. Can I can I whip one of these? Yeah, yeah, what's up? What's up? I lit you on fire. Uh oh. Okay, they're still as vicious as ever. Alright, see so yeah, I'm all tops very good against these. Just gonna go ahead and do that. Oh shoot, there's another one. Yep, just gonna use these all up. Oh no! Heal! Ah! Hit him again! Alright, now I can just probably shoot him and finish him off here. Boom! Okay, whew. Didn't really want to shoot him on the last one. Probably could have just ran up and got him, but I was panicking. I was definitely panicking. Oh, we're maxed out on blood vials, though. Alright, well, that was. I lost some bullets, but that was worth it. Alright, I do remember that there's something up here. And I don't quite want to go over there. Because it looks a little terrifying. There's like a dude there. I can't remember exactly what's up here. But I'm kind of scared to go this way. I have like a lot of fear building. I hear voices. Is it just in my head now? Oh shoot! Ah! That scared me. Oh. Jeez, this game is just full of just jump scares for me. Okay, we do have a way we can go down here. There's an item right there. Okay, I'm probably gonna go that way. I'm not really fond of continuing this path. I mean, I guess I could fight that guy. But there's just some, something in me is just saying, don't do it. Oh, man, there's, like, people walking around in here. Oh, yeah, I see him. I see him. I'm gonna get you, man. I'm gonna get you before you get me. Yeah. Oh, I only have two Molotovs left. I can't believe I burned eight of them on those two werewolves. I see you back there. I see you in the shadows. I ain't afraid of you. Alright, we're good on blood vials, but the thing is my health is still so low that it doesn't take a whole lot. I see you right there too. Yeah, come fight me. Are you too scared? Are you too scared? Man, I hate it when they do things like shh, shh. It's like what is there, like, more of you? Alright, you know what? You're gonna get the whip. I usually don't give anybody, just anybody the whip, but you got it. Oh, man. Camera just completely... I guess because it's dark in here. Oh, I did a jumping attack. I didn't even mean to. Alright. You are Toasterino. 
there anything? There's a door. It doesn't open from this side. I hate when doors say that. I see an item, but I hear voices. Can I open this? I can. Ooh, that looks nice out there. Alright, well, let's leave that open. Let's see if I can discover where these guys are hiding here. See some sparkling stuff in the corner? Oh, there's. Some bullets. Ugh. Oh, he had like a cannon. Look at that. That would have been bad. Pungent blood cocktail. A mature blood cocktail thrown to attract beasts. Ah. So like those werewolf things, I guess? When the hunt began, the healing church left us, blocking the great bridge to the cathedral ward as old Yarnum burned to the ground that moonlit night. Alright. So, yeah, they just abandoned the people. It says they just blocked the great bridge. And, uh, old Yarnum burned. Just abandoned them. I wonder why. Was it planned? Did they... Did they start it with their special blood or something like that? Maybe. All right, back to sword mode. All right, bonkin' mode, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, I feel a lot less anxious uh, going this way compared to across whatever I was going there. Oh, we got some big dudes. I feel someone coming. I heard those footsteps. Exactly like what got me last time that scared me, so I just I just knew it was footsteps behind me. Getting better at the jump scares. Alright, another bloodstone chart. We'll be able to do some serious upgrades. Oh hey. I hear that cough. Oh, we're back at this. Nice. That's nice. Across the valley to the east of Yarn, deep All right, that's the uh, same stuff that we heard last time. So he's not impressed that we came through the other door, but that's okay. Let's go back to the hunter's dream. Oh, <sighs> I'm imagining like Dark Souls that probably respawns all the enemies, um, but that's okay. We have a shortcut now, so we can go back and fight those big dudes that were wandering around. Maybe take a couple different paths before I go. Go that way that I feel suspicious about. Can we talk to this thing yet? Nope. How about going... Ooh, hello. It's not a dude with a cannon because he doesn't have a light. A couple lanterns on him. Plus he's here, I would guess. Not an enemy. Hello. Aha. You must be the new hunter. Welcome to the hunter's dream. This will be your home for now. I am Gehrman, friend to you hunters. You're sure to be in a fine haze about now, but don't think too hard about all of this. Just go out and kill a few beasts. It's for your own good. You know, it's just what hunters do. You'll get used to it. Okay. This was once a safe haven for hunters. A workshop where hunters used blood to enhance their weapons and flesh. We don't have as many tools as we once did, but you're welcome to use whatever you find. That's a little weird. This was once a fuel even. <laughs> All right. Well, I guess this is like our home thing, storage here. Oh, that's pretty sweet. Store all our treasures if we want. Uh, we got a fire and some books we knocked over. Probably all ruined by now. We can repair our weapons. Yes, I'll repair that. And we can fortify them. Boost the damage. That's pretty sweet. 
and also it looks like it'll somehow boost our attribute bonus which is always a nice thing too uh, yeah that looks all right not gonna do it just yet because I want to look around Let's see to escape this hunter's dream halt the source of the spreading scourge of the beasts lest the night carry on forever oh well, that's not good the night of the hunt is not simply a thing I can nap away shoot well there's no no beds to have a nap in here anyways okay whatever I could do here the tool is missing um, yeah all right so is there anything else that's new now that he's talked to us he said we could use the doll does that mean that the doll can be talked to nope just as an abandoned doll still well, and thus that's that's what he means Ugh. <laughs> I didn't think I didn't take him literally jeez well, should we boost it what's it gonna cost it says three uh, blood echo blood shards well let's hold off I don't quite want to upgrade my cane just yet but is there like a way I can like uh, level up or something like that we can buy more molotovs yeah I'm gonna buy a couple I'll buy one there we go good to have some molotovs uh, I guess uh, Yeah, there's just more headstones, I guess, to travel to different places. And yeah, oh, I thought we would unlock some uh, some places to level up or something. Maybe I have to like uh, rest or something like that. Let's see, if we go to uh, let's just go to the first floor sick room, I guess. Oh, does this have a thing that I can like warp back from? I might have just made a grave mistake. This might be just the place where I got my butt whooped. I don't remember. I don't remember there being like a little lantern here, but there might be now. Oh, there was. Okay, good. Right, so back to the dream. Kind of sucks to have to go through loading, through two loading screens for this, but. I just want to see if anything changes after you talk to them that hasn't changed yet. I thought you could talk to... No? Okay. Well, I'm just confused and mistaken. I guess I'll have to wait till the game tells me how to level up, because that's the thing I'd like to do mostly to get more stats. Uh, so I can feel a little bit more durable, because I'm probably going to walk into things and just die a whole bunch. Bath appears link to the nightmare but there are no messengers that's cryptic I don't know what that means holy chalice is required to conduct oh, there's like rituals we have to do or something like that damn this seems a uh... makeshift altar was this oh my gosh I don't know what that's all about what's down here just to finally explore our oh yeah this is just some tutorial stuff. Just hitting enemy from behind with the charge attack causes them to stagger. Oh, that's good to know. And we can charge our... Oh, okay. We can do a transforming attack with that. So you can transform it back or you can do like that. That's cool. Emergency quick. Yeah, I did that by accident. Switch weapons. Just like Dark Souls, cool. Toggle items, yep. That all seems pretty standard for me. Alright, well, I think that's going to be it for the first episode. I think we'll uh, continue on, obviously, and go explore some more areas next time. And maybe find out how to get some more HP. But until then, we're a little bit more safe and a little bit more prepared for next time. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.